Hello, my prison mates. Sorry for that clap, but I'm so excited to play the prison boys once again. We have nine tickets left. Finally, we have less tickets left, and I have enough time for today just to play the prison boys. But I think we're gonna get into the next chapter because we just met Yamato last, like last episode. We let we met Yamato. He's like you know angry and bitchy and moody, just like a girl. So yeah. So. Here we go with eight tickets left. Ooh. Alright. So. Great. Shut up. Just follow me. What? Yamato? Kuji and Yamato were talking in a thin adult looking. St we're talking to a thin adult looking student. <gasps> oh my god, it's a guy! It's a guy! It's a boy! It's a little boy! With a student. Please, let go. The man was obviously timid. He was pleading his innocence through tear filled eyes. Yamato, who's that? This guy is a rebel. He's against the will of the Empire. No, I didn't do anything. I'm not a rebel. The man who was desperately yelling of his innocence looked at us and opened his eyes wide. Mr. Saki, please help me. What? Nagi was surprised and widened his eyes. There was a flash of disappointment on this on this on the man's face. Ah! Oh! What you what you know this guy? Yamato looked at Nagi with sharp eyes. No. Nagi, you were negated with a puzzled look. Then get out of my way. Now you follow me. I'm not a rebel. What? Wait. Why do you think this man is a rebel? I don't need. I don't need you to tell me the reason here. The only problem is this guy's a rebel. Move out of my way. Move out of the way. I want to know why. We'll interrogate him later. Get away. No. Ding ding, round two, round three with Yamato. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna stop making jokes here. Okay. It was a touch. It was a touch and go situation. Like Kuji was going was trying to break the tension. Be quiet. What's happening? General Kongu appeared. Yamato gave a salute to him. Uh, yes, sir. We arrested Rebel. We are going to interrogate this man, but they tried to hinder us. I was saluting as they did it. General Kongu looked sharply at us. Are you trying to hinder St. Tenshi's against a rebel? N no. I'm not a rebel. We'll see the truth after an interrogation. Kuji, Yamato, take him off. Yes, sir. Why are you cinnamon roll mad? I don't like to see a cinnamon roll mad. Sorry about the notifications. I hate to see a cinnamon roll mad. Yes, sir. Kuji and Yamato took the young man away. Oh no. Poor boy. I don't like, I don't like this. Okay, let's go for the next story. Ladies and gentlemen, we have gone to chapter 4 after this situation. Now, we have gone to chapter 4. We are going to end this chapter 4 part 1. Ladies and gentlemen, let's watch this story unravel even more. Kuji Yamato took the young man in. General Kongu walked up to us. The crowd soon disappeared, like a stern wave. I've tolerated things you've done because I thought you would need time to overcome your brother's death, but if you go too far, I will have to take action. They're nervous. 
You are Teo Kiko H. You have devoted your hearts to the Empire. Just think, just think about arresting rebels and doing your best for the nation. If you are dead, similar things and snoop around like a rat, it will be considered as rebel in the revelation. Revelation. Keep that firmly in mind. Saying this, General Kongu then walked away. He said if he stoop around like a rat, maybe he knows about what how we've been up to. I don't know, but we can't keep quiet. Who's that guy Yamato caught? She called me Mr. Saki. You don't know him, do you? No, I don't think he's even he's even some really someone in to my family. He was mixed up with you and Naya, maybe. I thought so too. We should make sure of it. Say, do you think we can meet him? Probably. He's in a cell. Are you going to sneak in the prison again? What if we get caught? Remember General Kongu's look? I got goosebumps all over my body. I'm not going to force you to come with me. I'll go alone if you don't want to. Nagi looks serious. I can't let you go alone. I'll go with you. Thanks. After curfew, we slide out of our room where people were sleeping. Shh. The city? Townsville. <laughs> so, why am I making a pop of girl joke in, like, an anime game? We came to the 7th basement of the prison. It's pretty quiet. Is he the only person in custody now? Things have been hectic since Naya's death, so I don't think there's anyone but him. Okay, we're gonna read this story next, and then after this we're gonna cut off here. Only found one cage was locked behind bars. I saw a black shadow wrapped in a ball. He whispered to the shadow, Good evening. Oh! Oh, poor kid. I, I, I feel bad for him, though. We heard an uptight voice. Then we heard something creep on the wall. Shh, please be quiet. Please stop it. I don't know anything. With the sound of breathing, he barely whispered something in a low voice. I'm not a rebel. I'm so scared. Please stop it. We're not going to put you into torture. We came to listen to your story. <sighs> looks like he wants to die already. He looks like he's tired. Can you see me? Now he shone a flashlight on his face. Ah! You are! I saw you earlier! I'm Naya Saki's younger brother, Nagi Saki. Mr. Saki's younger brother. We don't suspect you as a rebel, but there's one thing we want to know. Do you know Naya Saki? Oh. The man didn't say anything for a little while, but after ta taking a deep breath, he said shakily, Mr. Saki, where is Mr. Saki now? He died. Just like with that like monotone, like, he died. Okay? <laughs> what? We found him hanging in his room. He hanged himself? The young man opened his eyes wide, shocked out of his wits. Naya's death was, was treated as a suicide. We don't think so. We want to know the truth of Naya's death. Tell us anything. We want to know anything about him you know. Uh -uh. He seemed to understand our dis desperation and slowly got closer to us. He seemed to have already gotten it. 
the third degree. His cheeks were moist with tears. He looked sickly and pale. However, he straightened his back and said clearly, I'd like to know the truth. If you can prove you two are trustworthy. Trustworthy? Hmm. How can we prove it? Tetsu, do you have any ideas? How can you earn his trust? Well, let's see, hold on. I'm right back. <laughs> gotta check the walkthrough. So it says present, now he has two side notes. We gotta find that. Yeah, it's suicide note. Here we go. I took out now your suicide note and showed it to to the young man. This is now your suicide note. We found it in his room. <laughs> He gazed at the letter and then slowly nodded. It's definitely Mr. Saki's handwriting. Thank you. I'll trust that you two are not lying. And then he started to talk. Okay, I think we're going to end the episode right here. And I will finish these tickets today. So, um... Yeah, we're going to hear the story next episode. So I'll see you, prison mates, later. Bye-bye!